Hi guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to make this microphone icon animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So friends, finish video, I will share project files for download. And first of all, let's create a new background. Right mouse, new and solid. Add name background, click OK. And go to FX presets, search effect fill. And select the fill, let's use for this background. Go to color cube. And let's select background like this. Click OK. Then lock background. And go to here, let's click this icon and select title action save. Then go to pen tool. And let's hold shift, make one line. Click session tool, go to click fill, select none for close fill color, click OK. Then go to stroke, change stroke with 10. And let's open here, contents, shape 1, stroke 1, change butt cup to round cup for smooth shape layer. Then change name, line 1. OK, and let's move to here. Nice. Then select this line and go to add and select trim pads. Let's open trim pads here. Let's close stroke. Okay. And change end zero. Make end shape frame. And go to FFK frames. Change end 100. Select shape frames. Make easy. Go to graph editor. Select this graph. Let's make smooth. Let's see. Okay. Back to shape frames. Select this. Last shape frame, let's move to right. Okay, go to graph editor, select these graphs. Let's move to left. Move to left again. Okay, nice. So, let's select these shape frames and move to right. Okay, good. Okay, so let's close line settings and go to here. Go to pen tool. Let's make one line like this. Hold shift again. Make one line. Click session tool. Okay. And select this line. Press U for C K frames. And select this end. Control C. Select this shape layer 1. Go to first second. Control V. Let's see. Nice. So let's again open shape layer 1 contents and shape 1 here stroke and change again butt cup to run cup okay and select this line press u and select this line press u go to last shape frames okay and let's go to here hold this icon select this ellipse tool hold shift make one ellipse Click session tool and go to here. Let's control V the stream pads effect. Let's see. Okay, nice. Let's go to here and select the shape layer. Press U and let's click this icon for create new shape frame. Select last shape frame. Delete. Let's see. Nice. Let's select this shape layer. Press R. Change 90. Okay, and go to here, select the shape layer. Let's move to here like this. Okay, nice. So let's open settings, contents, ellipse one, and stroke, change, butt cup to round cup. Okay, so in this time, let's change line size. Let's select this, change line two. Okay, first step, select this line, change stroke width. Let's try 20, like this. Okay, and select this line, chain 20, and this, 20. Okay, so, let's select this line and go to pen tool, select this right point, hold shift, move to left, for chain size. Nice, select this line 2, let's select this shape layer, let's move to right. Okay, select this line 2, let's see size. Okay, let's select this and move to center like this. 
Nice. Let's select this line too. Move to right. Move to right again. Okay, let's select these layers. Press U and select the shape frames. Move to left for fast animation. Move to left again. Okay. Let's select this line too. Move to left. Nice. So, select this shape layer too. Change the circle like this and let's move to here press s change scale and change this 25 move to down like this okay and select the circle let's move to right okay so select the circle press u select your frames go to graph editor and let's select this graph make like this and this okay let's move it down nice back to chain frames select this line to press u select chain frames go to graph editor let's make smooth graph okay not bad so let's select this line too. Go to pen tool and select this point and hold shift, move it down. And select this circle, move it down also. Okay, nice. So in this time, let's go to shape layers and select this round and range tool. Let's make like this. Click session tool and chain stroke width. 20 move to here let's try change size press s change size let's change 85 move to here and in this time let's open settings and open range pet one change roughness like this for sphere or circle then click this icon and change like this for circle okay nice and select this shape layer go to here let's press p make new patching key frame move to down go to 10 key frame let's move to up go to again 10 key frame move to down go to again 10 key frame move to up Again, go 10 keyframe of the down, and again, go 10 keyframe of the up. This more keyframes for smooth animation. Let's select keyframes and make easy. Let's see. Okay, select keyframes. Let's hold Alt, move to left. Let's Control Z. Okay, and go to here. Select first keyframe, move to down, and let's see. Okay, let's move to up. Okay, let's move to right. Okay, let's move to right like this, and move to down. Okay, nice. So in this time, go to here. Open settings, open contents, and range one, range pet one, and let's make size keyframe frame and roughness keyframe. frame. Go to here, and let's try change size like this and like this, and change like this roughness. Okay, let's see. Nice. Select shape frames, make easy. Let's see. Okay, so select shape frames. Let's move to left. Nice. Let's select shape frames. Let's try move to right. Okay, not bad. Let's move to left. Okay, that's good. So in this time, let's change name, Mike, 
or microphone and select these lines let's control D for duplicate moved up and moved up like this let's see okay press S change scale and let's move to left control D move to down again control D move to down okay and let's move to right like this okay so let's select these lines link to microphone layer and move to left let's see nice let's move to left try very nice so in this time go to pen tool and let's make one line like this clickation tool and go to add let's open wiggle pads let's change stroke width and open wiggle pad one let's try to change size like this and change that tool okay and change points smooth let's see okay let's try to change wiggle speed like this let's change one let's see okay this is very slow let's change this five okay not bad and open stroke one change butt cup to round cup let's see okay nice so select the shape layer and go to pen tool select this last point hold shift move to left okay so select this line change wave and move to right okay let's move to right like this okay nice let's move to left this wave shape layer and change stroke width nice and select this wave control D and move to left nice so select this line press U select this end chain frames control C and select this wave 2 and wave layer control V press U select chain frames move to left okay then select this wave 2 for left and let's open team parts effect and close end chain frame then chain start 100 go to here make start chain frame go to here chain start zero select chain frames make easy let's see nice so let's select this move to down and this okay not bad so thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe channel like video and please follow me on instagram good luck